when somebody is applying for a job, you're telling me they apply one job at a time until they get rejected or they apply for multiple jobs and let the jobs come to them where they can have an option to choose which job is best fit and have a better chance at getting a job for one. But women so, aren't the applicants. Women are the job. You're not the applicant. The you're the job. Yeah, you're the job. You're not the one applying. Are you hollering at dudes? No. You're the job. I didn't say me, but there's women who do. The vast <laughs> majority of women, do. the vast majority of women are not shooting their shot. They shot their shot and it worked. They're trash. Women are trash at shooting their shot. Oh, what cologne are you wearing? I made in my pants. Oh, oh you want to make in my pants? No, thank you, Captain. <laughs> oh, I almost had them. Women are absolute, because again, they don't understand men and they've never had to use anything outside their sexuality. Women shooting their shot is doing this shit. Men really, we really no, my, have to uh, talk some shooting shit. Shooting their shot is just looking. And... <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I looked at him at a 45 degree angle. He should have right. known that I wanted I, him. I gave no, him a slight smile and he didn't do nothing. So that was Listen, my way of shooting my shot. <laughs> one, one of the messages, uh, one of the questions I ask is like, if you were a dude for a day, what kind of dude would you be? Um, and I've asked a lot of women this question. They would be trash. They wouldn't get no pussy. They, for real, because they don't understand the game. Number one, y'all don't know how to deal with rejection. No, we Number, don't. Number two, y'all don't have to. Most women have never had to develop a talk game. Women who can talk are usually the below average looking women because they had to compensate for their lack of. I don't, the I'm beautiful not women. Below average then, because I know how to ha hold a conversation. <laughs> no, no, I'm not talking about hold a conversation. I'm talking about like shoot your shot at somebody. Like he might have been iffy of if, if he wanted to do something, you convince him. We have to convince our way for the most part. Not really. If she's interested off back. For the mo but it's ours to lose. Cause like I said before, most women are looking for a reason to disqualify us. Some so even guys. like even keeping your game you know is I've like I've seen it. I've seen it where it was a guy approached my friend a long time ago and I was like, he's cute. And she was like, mm, your shoes dirty. And she like walked off and I was like, let, let 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 that let that let that handsome ass dude open his mouth and he ain't got no bass in his voice. Dead completely. I'm not that picky. I mean, you can't be sounding like I don't know. I, I have a very sultry voice for a woman, so I, my voice can't be deeper than yours. But you know. think of the most handsome guy you know. If he sounded like Tweety Bird. I'm a tweet with a bird in a field of page. Tweet is my name, but I don't know my age. It now, would see, not that's, happen. No, that's not normal. But that's what I'm talking about, though. Like these things. And, or if he, he smelled bad. Practice. He better get in you know there and me, me, me. <laughs> but, but my point is, it's, it's ours to lose. So even the game of like, like a woman literally can can do her thing and like not say a word. Because y'all, and again, goes goes back to y'all's strength. Y'all strength is seduction. Y'all strength is influence. That looking shit that you're talking about, mm -hmm. that shit can really actually do some shit. But again, if you <laughs> lose that, if you turn into a dude and now that look looks like leering, it doesn't work anymore. So again, you know, the, the whole point of this whole conversation, no, we've been going to do for it a while. Too, and I, like you'll be confused because like, is he looking at me? I don't know. Am I looking at him? Does he, are we looking at each other? Like it, men are doing that now too. Men are not really yeah. approaching, especially if they're yeah, shy. They, they, they don't. Like, they don't want to get. They don't want to get embarrassed. They, they probably had a chance. I'll give advice to men. Don't be so direct. Don't be so direct. Just listen. You know, break it down. Go ahead. Say, Let me get your number. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just come up to a woman and say. Hi, how are you? My name is so-and-so. I saw you across the room and I just wanted to let you know you look so beautiful tonight. Um, what are you drinking on? Or how's your day been? Or what brings you here? And see if she's receptive to the conversation. She's looking like, why are you talking to me? Just say, okay, well, I just wanted to acknowledge you tonight and just let you know you look good. And then walk off. Now, if she's like, oh yeah, talking, da 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 then that's when you kind of go in and say, well, I would love, I don't want to, I don't want to interrupt your night. I see you busy with your friends and stuff, but is there any way, um, would you like to talk more maybe over drinks or something one day? And then kind of reel it in with that. 
just don't just be like, hey, you cute. Can I get your number? Okay. Enough of the big screen. <laughs> I feel like I'm on the spotlight right now. <laughs> no, nah, that's fact. That's 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 facts. That's fact. That's actually really good advice. And that's what I asked. That always um, worked. Like if, if a guy yeah. approached me like that and I'm like, you just acknowledge me as a human being and not just mm-hmm. be like, Can I get your number? Like you don't even know how I sound. You don't even know if I have a man or anything mm-hmm. just kind of just be like you know what i'm not trying to interrupt your day i know you're busy and everything but your beauty you, your beauty caught my eye mm-hmm. i just wanted to let you know if, if you if you if you're available to talk you don't even gotta ask if i got a man or not just but my my thing my thing too though my thing too though um you know from a male perspective and really really de- think, like thinking deep about this shit, we were taught to prematurely pedestalize women so when we see you from across the room, our initial assumption is that, damn, she smell like fairy dust and her hair is that she wake up looking like this and all that shit. So what, what I would say before you even approach the woman is take a second, take a beat to really think to yourself, do I actually want to get to know her? Is there something about her that's interesting or is this just hormones and I, I, I want to have sex with her? Because I think if it's just hormones and yeah. you just want to have sex with her, that's where you can get the uh hey how you doing and she immediately says get out of my face versus if you take a beat to actually observe her and see kind of get a sense of i've been telling men is she worth my time before you approach is she worth my time that's a different and then i think what you're saying is phenomenal i think it absolutely that's always uh, is the way to go always got me like i i love a man that can just kind of come up and just want to have a conversation i'll talk to you i may not be interested in you initially but if we're having like a great conversation i'm just gonna give you my number anyway because i'm just like man like i'm glad you just came up just to talk to me instead of just saying hey can i get your number like it kind of just made me feel like you're just trying to grab numbers for the night hey if you've made it all the way to the end please click that like and subscribe button also share this with somebody that you think would gain value from it Also, shout out to our Patreon executive producers and VIP members. Make sure you head over to Patreon and check out some exclusive content. A lot more happens on Patreon that can happen on YouTube. So please uh, consider becoming a member there. Click the thumbnail at the top if you want the full video. Click the thumbnail at the bottom if you want a video that's closely related to this. Again, like, share, subscribe. Appreciate you guys for watching. Check out some more of our content. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.